I found this article I want to use as a close read with the kids using Inmodo. The first thing that I need to do is change it from the internet and make it into Adobe Reader. To do this, you need to go and you need to find where it says print by where the article is. Over here is where it says print. Click on it and now it makes it to where you only see what the article is. Uh, you're not done. You need to go up to file, print. You're not actually printing. You need to come down here to where it says PDF. Click on PDF. Go to open PDF and preview. Click on that. And now you are in Adobe. Uh, this is one of the Adobe's that we have. We have another one, uh, Adobe Reader, which I think is a little bit more kid friendly. There is highlighting, um, but right here is the highlighter. Uh, but let me show you what the other Adobe looks like. Go to File, Save, and now I'm going to save this on my desktop. I have the kids do this each time. It allows them uh, to get to the article quickly without having to go on to the internet. So I minimize these. The Veteran Stay is down here. Double click on it. Adobe Reader comes up. And you can see it's a little bit different. Click on comment. Now you have all of these um, tools on the side to use. This is for highlighting. Uh, so kids can highlight words that they don't know. Uh, right here is for underlining. Say important information. I also use a text box which is this icon, and you can have the kids answer a question to the article. Okay, and so that's basically how I have the kids uh, annotate using the Adobe Reader. Then they come over and they hit file and they save it. This will save right onto their desktop. Um, and each day they can go back and they can make changes, highlight in different colors. Um, that's the way that you do it using articles from the internet. You basically need to do the same thing. Let's say I have a Word document. Here's an essay that I had. Um, and let's say this is from N the MC Higgins. Um, and if I give this to the kids, they can change anything on here. I don't want that. I want the article to stay exactly the way that it is. So you need to go to File, Print, and again it's the PDF. Open in PDF Preview. Go to File, Save. Okay, save it. And when I minimize this, the article is now down here. It opens. And I can't make changes if I want to. So um, again, I can now do highlighting if I want. And that's the using um, a Word document and changing it into Adobe Read.